Jeez, oh, leavers. Oh, my Jesus. We got ourselves a brand new type of game. We gotta walk the ropes, brother. Well, not quite brother, because that's not... That's not Hulk Hogan. That's Scott Hall. Reza Ramon. Chico. Anyway, moving back, the extreme events here. We're going to have Giants Unleashed in a little bit, which looks really exciting. In fact, when the video goes out, Giants Unleashed would have begun. So let me know what you think about it and how broken it is, because every new event is broken. If it isn't, it's a miracle. Possibly a Christmas miracle. So we've got a bunch of stuff to do. We've got to wild our Wednesday stuff, our stockings. And we've got to walk the ropes. But there's only one place to start, and that is by saying, God damn, that like button's in the way of the stocking stuffer, and I need that stocking stuffer to get this challenge done. I'll be seriously disappointed if we do not. Well, we did get one stocking from the Gathering Gifts quest. I, did, I literally just realized that. I literally just realized that. I didn't realize it was, it was beforehand. So I can't open up the next one to get Alexa Bless all the thing without your help. So all you gotta do is just smack the like button and we'll make it possible. Well, I hope you can. Unless you've got like no hands. And that, that's that's slightly a problem. Got toes, toes, toes work. Did I just say toe the like button? Or did, you know, just leg drop or knee drop the like button? Like, like Ric Flair did, does to like apples and books and stuff. Whatever, let's get our stocking stuff a pack to start off with. You guys know the drill with this. 750 credits, might give us something good, probably gonna give us something bad. It's giving us something pretty bad. It's a primal, big E. And of course, it's laughing. Wonderful. And obviously, this gives us one more extra towards the quest. Oh, I'm doing this. Rocking back and forth to get ourselves the Fiend or Alexa Bliss. But in the meantime, I'm going to get the Krampus card back. Because I completely forgot to get this in the previous upload. But we got it! Krampus card back is done. Although, no, it, it just, that's really weird. It gave us it to us twice. We've also got some tickets, so we're going to open up a ticket pack quickly. 25 of the beautiful, most beautiful tokens in the world. And, ooh, okay. At least we've got two Season 7 cards in here. We've got Cat Days and F3, Candice LeRae, and Robert Stone, who I believe is a pro. I'm pretty sure he's a pro anyway. And I've got a couple of extra enhancements and stuff. That wasn't exactly what I wanted. But you can't be too I know, picky over Season 7 cards. Any more Candice LeRae's though, and I'm going to end up like King Kin. Anyway, four extra tickets. Thank you very much. Couple of extra credits. We're almost gonna, I mean, to be honest with you, the only thing that really benefits me from Wild Wednesday now, and I'd like to hope they have the Christmas cards in Wild Wednesday, is the actual superstars themselves, because I got the Paul Heyman in yesterday's Bounty Breaker. If you haven't seen that, you need to go and check it out. And whilst you're there, WWE Universe for Swarm, I like it. If you haven't checked out the video down here, we did a sponsored piece, which I am so excited with the guys at 2K for a special top tip to guys who are just starting off in the game, you might even learn something if you're a vet. But it's a special video between me and 2K. Very much appreciate if you go and watch it. Let's get into the Wild Wednesday pack. This is the big one. And three. Go! Oh, we've got Kitty and Dane. We actually did get, we did get a Christmas one. A Swarm Kitty and Dane. That is a brand new card from the Wild Wednesday. There you go, <laughs> I almost called him Shedrick. Shedrick Alexander, Shedrick. No one's pressure off me. If you haven't seen that, seriously, go watch Alicia Fox, Shedrick Alexander, YouTube, just do it. But I'm happy. That's that's a really cool little reward there. Nice. There's the Krampus card back. So I, I'll use that for a couple of days before I go back to the gingerbread. For those of you who haven't seen it, allow me to introduce you to the new draft board, even though I actually hoped and expect, well, kind of expected, them to do something new with the draft board because the fusion chamber is lit up by Christmas lights and snow and craziness. I kind of expected them with what they did for the previous events in season six to bring like massive snow mounds and it was snowing and you know jingle bells and like a, maybe a Christmas based holiday lights. Again, I'll explain all this in just a second, but I didn't. They've just done it to the fusion chamber, which is a little bit odd. 
Whatever. So it's looking very festive in the fusion chamber. You get your bulbs off the lot of the draft board. I almost called it off the light board there. You get your bulbs off the draft board. You then get either these neon lights or you get a down light instead. Why? There we go. Okay. And the, the, the oh, not down light, but a drop light. These drop lights you use for the make it dark fusions, the neon fusions or the neon light fusions give you a uh, one of the following, which might include a Summer Sam 20 Extreme Superstar, but the bonus chances are purely and simply to do with the Holiday Superstars. Whereas the drop lights, or is it a drop light? Yeah, drop lights are all about the extreme cards. Everything about it is extreme, apart from the chance of getting yourself Bray Wyatt or Alexa Bliss which is like a little added bonus. Otherwise, there is no extra access to the winter cards in this. The Christmas cards are nowhere to be seen. So that Reza Ramon is challenging me to go to walk the ropes. And this is brand new. You go around an actual board, like a board game, and it's a little bit mad, personally. I think this is great based on what I've seen. Varying different luck <laughs> across the board, literally across the board, because it is like a board game. No free chance, which I think is a little bit, you know, my thoughts are, if you've watched any videos beforehand, you would know my belief is that everything should be able to be obtainable at least once for free. That's just my opinion. But you get a it contains six of the following, plus a bonus chance if you go around the whole board. Has access to enhancements, super coins, loads of other stuff. No Alexa Bliss, but it does include Bray Wyatt. So let's get started. I don't know what the, the, the odds, the chance of the full reward is 16%. You have access to the extreme cards and you have access to the Christmas cards on this. So either or, we're going to try it. If you've done this yourself, comments in the comment section. Let me know what you think. Let's go. You're gonna press the button in the middle. Tap to continue. Walk in those ropes, boy. I'm not sure what happened. Oh no, we have to press the start. So we've got the Eddie Guerrero little uh, counter at the top here. Got a bunch of different rewards. Now I've been told, walk the ropes gives you access to a draft board. The KO means you're out of the game completely. So let's press the big red button. What does it do? Does it, <laughs> the base gonna eliminate it straight away. Stop on six. What does this do? It gives us a hundred credits. Love it. Please don't be a one. Let's start. And two, we get to walk the ropes, which that flying elbow. Ooh, I like. Let's go middle. So it's 150 super coins. That's pretty sweet. Okay. Let's go bottom right. Another set of super coins, okay. This gives us three picks. And 100 credits. So not amazing, but not the worst thing in the world either. Pretty cool so far. Okay, so start. And stop. Six. Oh, God. Tap to claim your rewards, okay. So we got 500 super coins from that and 200 credits. So it only costs us 2,300 credits, and we got a bunch of super super coins as well. So they can be bad, it can be good. I know personally I'm not that pleased with it, but I have seen some people pull some crazy stuff off the board. And I believe you have to go through around the whole board at least once. And this is the, those are the, the ropes as such. Let's go. Start your engines, people, because we're about to travel around this draft board as quick as possible. Stop. Six. Okay, so this gets us a hundred credits. Please don't be a one. Got three. Little snowball pack. Okay, jo the guys have been with the company for ages. So what I don't want is a one, two, three, four, five. I don't want a five. Let's go. We've got a six. Okay. Another snowball pack. Where's the Blake? Okay. So what we do want is a one, two, three, four, five. A five is what we want here. Let's start and stop. Two. Draft ten draft picks, of course. So we don't want. Four or five, because then we get knocked out. Two, another snowball pack. Kofi Kingston. So we want one, four, five or six. Let's go. Oh no, we got knocked out. 
Wow. Do I feel like slightly shortchanged? That was, uh, and it's got this glitch apparently when you finish it, there's like a glitch that um, randomly sends the everything into craziness. So you got to fix that supercar, but um, we're going to close the game out and we're going to reopen it. So my luck wasn't too good. Maybe you've tried it. Uh, personally, I feel that my pool should have been a bit better and maybe they should guarantee you at least, at least one extreme card, personally. That's just me. What do you guys think? Let me know in the comment section. Kind of semi-decent Wild Wednesday as well, so not all been bad. Giants Unleashed is coming up. But ladies and gentlemen, that is about time for me. Hope you have a wonderful day wherever you are. Make sure you're leaving a comment in the comment section and you are leaving a like on the video. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out. Oh, and don't forget, join the Discord community. Link's going to be in the description and the comments down below. Peace out. Bye-bye. So